April. The latest numbers show more than nine and a half million people have visited the Great Smoky Mountains this year from January through September. That is a record setting pace and no sign of slowing down with October always one of the busiest months of the year in the park. Now more people means more chances for emergencies on those hiking trails. 10 News reporter Jim Matheny explains the parks pushing visitors to pack the proper gear and check webcams for safety. Hope and hike for the best, but prepare for the worst. That's the message for anyone pounding the picturesque paths in the Smokies. Even if you're going out for just the day, it's important to have the equipment that you need should you get into any kind of trouble. Bob Gordon at the Nanahala Outdoor Center says always pack 10 essential safety items and you don't have to weigh yourself down like a pack mule. Just a quick starter kit and something to cover yourself up with. I mean, you're talking less than a pound. And first aid kits, water filters and whistles feel like overkill for a short hike. Well, short hikes are the ones that often kill in the park. Like one year ago when an Ohio woman on a day hike had nothing but her car keys, got lost near Klingman's Dome and died overnight from hypothermia. Rangers say many visitors get dressed for the weather in Gatlinburg, and then run into trouble when they get into higher elevations where it's 15 to 20 degrees colder, walking through a wilderness with no cell service. Make sure you have good shoes on. Make sure you have plenty of water because a lot of people will hike in flip-flops. The park installed new tools so conditions up top don't take hikers by surprise. You can now check webcams at Newfound Gap and Klingman's Dome for an up-to-date peek at the peaks. And not just the view. But also temperature, wind. A lot of times it'll rain. It cleans down when it's sunshiny down here in the Smokies. An awareness of the weather and a few lightweight items can help you prepare for the worst to make your hike in the Smokies the best. Because you never know what can happen. In the Great Smoky Mountains, Jim Matheny, WBIR 10 News. And we'll post links to the park's webcams and the 10 essential items for hiker safety at WBIR.com.